ഹലോ എവറി വൺ ഇത് നമ്മുടെ സീക്വൻസ് എന്നുള്ള ടോപ്പിക്കിലെ രണ്ടാമത്തെ ക്ലാസ്സാണ് അപ്പോൾ ആദ്യത്തെ ക്ലാസ്സിൽ നമ്മൾ സീക്വൻസിൻ്റെ ഡെഫിനിഷനും എന്താണെന്ന് പഠിച്ചു കുറച്ച് എക്സാമ്പിൾസ് കണ്ടു ഇവിടെ നമ്മൾ സിമ്പിളായിട്ടുള്ള ചില പ്രോബ്ലംസ് ആണ് ചെയ്യാൻ ഉദ്ദേശിക്കുന്നത് സോ ആദ്യത്തെ സെറ്റ് ഓഫ് പ്രോബ്ലംസിൽ നമ്മൾ ചെയ്യാൻ പോകുന്നത് എന്താണെന്ന് വെച്ച് കഴിഞ്ഞാൽ യു ഹാവ് ഗിവൺ എ എൻ എന്താണ് എ എൻ സീക്വൻസിലെ എന്ത് ടേം ആരാണെന്ന് പറഞ്ഞിട്ടുണ്ട് ഫൈൻഡ് ദ ഫസ്റ്റ് ഫൈവ് ടേംസ് ഓഫ് ദ സീക്വൻസ് ഇതാണ് നമ്മൾ ആദ്യം ചെയ്യാൻ പോകുന്നത് സോ ഫൈൻഡ് ഫസ്റ്റ് ഫൈവ് ടേംസ് ഓഫ് ദി സീക്വൻസ് സോ അതിനാദ്യത്തെ പ്രോബ്ലം നമ്മൾ ചെയ്യാൻ പോവാണ് നമുക്ക് തന്നിരിക്കുന്ന സീക്വൻസ് സീക്വൻസ് എൻ ബൈ എൻ പ്ലസ് വൺ വർ എൻ ഈക്വൽ ടു വൺ ടു ഇൻഫിനിറ്റി സോ ഹിയർ എ എൻ ഇസ് ഗിവൺ ആസ് എൻ ബൈ എൻ പ്ലസ് വൺ സോ വാട്ട് വിൽ ബി എ വൺ ഇൻസ്റ്റഡ് ഓഫ് എൻ ഗിവ് ദ വാല്യൂ വൺ സോ ദാറ്റ് വി വിൽ ഗെറ്റ് വൺ ബൈ വൺ പ്ലസ് വൺ which is 1 by 2 and a2 will be instead of n give 2 so you will get 2 by 2 plus 1 which is 2 by 3 then a3 it is 3 by 4 a4 is 4 by 5 and a5 is 5 by 6 ഇവിടെ നമുക്ക് ആദ്യത്തെ അഞ്ച് ടേംസേ കാണുന്നുണ്ടു സോ എ വൺ തുടങ്ങി എ ഫൈവ് വരെയുള്ളവരെ നമ്മൾ കണ്ടുപിടിച്ചു ആൻഡ് ദ സെക്കൻഡ് പ്രോബ്ലം ഇസ് ഗിവൺ ആസ് റൂട്ട് എൻ ബൈ ടു റേസ് ടു എൻ മൈനസ് വൺ വർ എൻ വാരീസ് ഫ്രം വൺ ടു ഇൻഫിനിറ്റി സോ എ എൻ എസ് റൂട്ട് എൻ ബൈ ടു റേസ് ടു എൻ മൈനസ് വൺ സോ വാട്ട് വിൽ ബി എ വൺ ഇറ്റ് ഈസ് റൂട്ട് വൺ ബൈ 2 raise to 1 minus 1 that is root 1 is 1 2 raise to 1 minus 1 is 2 raise to 0 which is again 1 so that a1 is 1 now what is a2 it will be root 2 by 2 raise to 2 minus 1 that means root 2 by 2 raise to 1 that means 2 this is 1 by root 2 now a3 it is root 3 by 2 raise to 3 minus 1 which is nothing but root 3 by 2 square which is 4 similarly a4 will be root 4 by 2 raise to 4 minus 1 that means root 4 is 2 by 2 cube you will get 1 by 2 square which is 1 by 4 now a5 will be root 5 by 2 raise to 5 minus 1 that means 2 raise to 4 60 okay now third problem is given as um minus 1 raise to n root of n minus 2 where n varies from 2 to infinity here n starts from 2 only so ipo thannirikkunna ee expression e njan an ennu thanne vilikkana so an equal to minus 1 raise to n root of n minus 2 namak kandu pidikkanda sequence ne njan sequence bn ennu vilikkunu ee sequence le aadyatha term b1 ennu paranjal ivu aalochikka an ile n starts from 2 so b1 is a2 hence we get minus 1 raise to 2 root of 2 minus 2 here 2 minus 2 is 0 so that this is 0 now b2 is a3 minus 1 cube root of 3 minus 2 minus 1 cube is minus 1 3 minus 2 is 1 so root 1 is 1 hence we have minus 1 now what is b3 it is a4 so minus 1 raised to 4 into root of 4 minus 2 minus 1 raised to 4 is 1 4 minus 2 2 so root of 2 so 
so we have root 2 now what is b4 it is a5 so minus 1 raised to 5 root of 5 minus 2 minus 1 raised to 5 is minus 1 and root of 5 minus 2 is root 3 so you have minus root 3 here now what about b5 it is a6 so you have minus 1 raised to 6 root of 6 minus 2 minus 1 raised to 6 is 1 root of 6 minus 2 means root 4 so you have 2 here root 4 is 2 uh, this was our third problem and the fourth, uh, fourth one is sequence sine of n pi by 3 where n varies from 0 to infinity if you e expression a and sine of n pi by 3 n is the same if you want to the sequence sequence b n so this sequence is the same it is a not because here n starts from 0 hence we have a not is sine of 0 pi by 3 that means sin 0 which is 0 now b2 is a1 so that it is sin of pi by 3 sin pi by 3 is root 3 by 2 now what about b3 b3 is a2 that is sin of 2 pi by 3 2 pi by 3 is in the second quadrant second quadrant we have sin positive so again we have root 3 by 2 what about b4 it is a3 means sin of 3 pi by 3 means sin pi which is 0 now b5 the fifth term is a4 sin of 4 pi by 3 which is minus of root 3 by 2 Okay. So, we will see the term in the sequence. We will see the term in the sequence. In the other type of problem, you have given the sequence explicitly. You have to find the nth term. So, first problem is you have 2, 3 by root 2, 4 by root 3, 5 by root 4, etc. So again see the 2 can be written as this 2 can be written as 2 by root 1, 3 by root 2, 4 by root 3 etc. So the first term in the denominator you have 2, in the second term in the uh, sorry in the numerator you have 2, in the second term in the numerator you have 3, third term in the numerator uh, 4 are another. So, nth term you will have n plus 1 in the numerator now what about the denominator it is first term root 1 second term root 2 third term root 3 etc so in the nth term you will have root n so this is the nth term of the first given sequence and the second sequence is 1 1 by 8 1 by 27, 1 by 64, etc. This needs no explanation. What will be a n? a n is 1 by n cube. Now the third problem. 1 minus 1 by 2, 1 by 3, minus 1 by 4, etc. So in the old, uh, look at the old positions. You have 1. 1 by 3 first position you have 1 third position we have 1 by 3 in the fifth position you will have 1 by 5 etc so that a n will be 1 by n if n is old now what about the even positions in the second position we have minus 1 by 2 fourth position minus 1 by 4 etc so that it is minus 1 by n if n is even or we can
can write a n equal to minus 1 raised to n plus 1 divided by n for any n element of natural numbers. In a name, a n in a represent a. In the item, sequence recursive item. Okay, we have given a1 equal to 2, a2 equal to 4, and a n plus 1 equal to 2 a n minus a n minus 1 for n greater than or equal to 3. Find next 5 terms of the sequence. So already we have under term to under term the a1 equal to 2 and a2 equal to 4. What will be a3? a3 will be 2 times a2 minus a1 using this formula. So that it is 2 times 4 minus 2, 8 minus 2, 6. a4 will be 2 times a3 minus a2. So 2 times 6 minus 4. That is 8. a5 will be 2 a4 minus a3. That means 2 into 8 minus 6. That is 10. A6 will be 2 A5 minus A4. So 2 into 10 minus 8. That is 12. And A7 is 2 A6 minus A5. Which is 2 into 12. 24 minus 10. It is nothing but 14. Okay. And a simple item of course problems on a session we discuss here. At the session, we will discuss the topic limit of a sequence. We will discuss the sequence and the definitions of the problems. We will discuss the limit of a sequence. Bye then.